Hello there everyone and thank you for joining me here at the start of a new campaign in Old World Blues, the A to Z series, which we're playing as Coover. We're led by a guy, or a person named is Winterborn, the Winterborn, and has been defending Bellingham for over 200 years. In a past life, he was a soldier, tasked with defending his home from an invading army. Now, radiation has ghoulified his body, yet that spirit for battle remains. The Winterborn's sole reason for living is to defend his home against any son of a gun who would dare to think they can take Bellingham from the people living there. We have Bellingham for battle. The city of Bellingham and Vancouver, due to their proximity to the Trans-Alaskan Pipeline, were key locations during the American-Canadian conflict. Many of the ghouls living in the city today remember these battles, fought in them even. They won't go quietly. And then we've got a lot of generic focus tree stuff here, so it's nothing too important, but we have a slightly, slightly part, or slight part of a unique focus tree, which we started with along this winter. We've been biding your time as winter continues to hold a grip on our land. We've lost many patrols of the cold, but their sacrifices won't be in vain. And we're going to go with carry on American traditions. The United States has had a tradition of treating the original people of these territories rather poorly. We can choose to move on from this dark past, but the winter born is an American at heart and longs for the days he felt were safer. It doesn't matter who's in his way, we will achieve that right now. A Silex Nation is a reminder of the American shame. Um, we could do embrace our forefathers' hatred. Our forefathers had the right idea. These people who can't stand up and defend themselves don't deserve a state or state of any kind. We'll tear their tip factories and workshops from the land and place them out of where they... Uh, out of their reach to keep them down and make it harder for them to revolt. God bless the USA or accept their forefathers' crimes. The Winterborn have been thinking a lot on this decision and the invasion of the Silex people. He wonders if his forefathers were wrong to treat them wrong. If violence was the wrong answer to a non existent problem. After much deliberation, he consulted the former chief Nkwala and asked for forgiveness for his actions. The woman smiled upon him and granted it, saying that we are not our ancestors and he did not carry a cruel legacy. We'll probably do this one because we don't get one, two, three, four, five cores. And more stability, so. We're going to go to war. You know, they're already fighting Camlo, but I don't really care. We'll do whatever we want here. So we got to keep waiting. We'll grab this one next. But we're doing all right. We're, like I said, a ghoul nation. So we try to get as many people who are ghouls here. It's like Adam Farnsworth, uh, James Early, uh, Christopher French, Allison Sims. Uh, not this guy. I chose Stephen Campbell anyways. Russell Wharton. Uh, Zach Sheridan is not a ghoul, but you know, whatever. Uh, there's only so many ghouls we have here. And as you can see, we're already out of manpower, but you know what else is new. Uh, I don't want to do something too ahead of the time. Resource efficiency gain, perhaps? So let's take a look-see. They've lost quite a few guys. We get 20%. That's not bad. We lost 12. Oh, the Dredgers. Oh, the Northern Coalition Dredgers and Campbell are fighting the same war together. So these guys are interesting. You can just hurry up and do that, you know. Colville. Sucks for these guys, but it's good for us. There you go. We made quite a few divisions. And here's the template we're working with. Uh, 20 combo with already. Four support companies. And then 20 combo with, with two support companies. So we're not perfect, but we're getting there. Head of the lake, huh? And strategy, tactical awareness and mapping and whatnot. That's nice. Good. Head of the lake. That'd be great. What percentage? 42% is not bad. Take you right there. There you go. Can we mobilize a little bit more? No. Military in both lives. Interesting. Service for volunteers. I wouldn't mind that, but we need more political power. Uh, lose a little bit of attack. Research speed goes down by 5%. You get 10% less division organization. 4% more recruitable population. Let's see what we can take here. This would really piss him off. Do we actually take this and hold against them? Because these guys have been fighting the entire time. Take them. Get a little bit of manpower. Additional plating's good. If we have rioters, of course. Um, it's a little ahead of time still. It's still a little ahead of time. Still a little ahead of time. There you go. Three days left. Uh, make sure you want to do all this stuff. We're using Overall Blues, Overall Blues, uh, Radio, Overall Blues, uh, Generic Decisions Revamped, Overall Blues ex Tech Expansion. Um, so we've got a lot of standard stuff uh, for Overall Blues. Here? No, not quite. Probably here. Yeah, my population's always good. Can we go here? No, we can't go there. Sorry. Fine. Outside our auxiliary zone. Place on Basic Tools are nice. Screw it. Just go grab this one next. 
It's a little ahead of time. We do have five research slots. So we're gonna go do this one and get five cores, ten percent more stability. I think that would be awesome. In the meantime, uh, we'll do that one too. We do want to form the Cascadian Republic as well, but it's gonna take some time. We need all the broken coasts under us and destroy the Washington Brotherhood. That's gonna take a long, long time, but we'll see. Oh, the dredgers are clearly one of the broken coasts. You know what? They're killing each other too. That's not bad. Fast technology, settle people down. Probably not. Science income. Uh, which one do we want? Threads of life. Thinking metal. Let's go thinking metal now. Um, population. Yeah, we can wait. The factors for the government. I don't want to lose weekly stability. That doesn't sound good to me. Throwing stuff under the ground is okay. It's not great. We need a draft. Well, we don't have to. The expanded officer training is not terrible either. Um, what am I doing this one? That's that's quite a bit. It's pretty good. I close it up. Cool. As you can see, we are going down conventional warfare as well. It's not bad. It's all right. It's just not great. We have something to be fine. Grab some of this. That would be good. Honestly, I wouldn't mind taking out Broken Coast too. But let's see what happens with this tree. Looking to the north, so the raiders LARPing his mounts are going for raids. Oh, let's show them a lesson. Oh, we get some guns. All right, it's not bad. Look, look at that. Some free cores. Our new cause. Let's show Kenneth what a real military force can do. Versus our new land. The blight has been defeated and our task is clear. Securing our land is assuring that people are free from the influence of the loppers is paramount. Hunting the remnants or remnants should the people's loyalty. Um, honestly, I wouldn't mind helping them out. They're fighting a couple different people. The faster we can take them out, the better, I think. Because then I can take out these guys, too. Can you all just, like, stack up here? No, I guess not. Mm. For now, until they become one solid unit in the front line. I really don't like Broken Coast. That's not bad. Promise Island? Bellingham? Here. Nice. About settlements. Looking to the north is good. Uh, we'll wait to go to war with those guys. I think it's best to wait. Combined arms are not bad. Subsidized weapons manufacturers. Why not? Uh, research speed would be good next. Thank you very much. Cultural advisors. Well, I did say I want ghouls. I prefer a head physician over this. In all honesty, 50% of recruitable population factor and monthly population. The same cost, only gives you 10% of recruitable population factor, and that's it. So it's not really worth doing. We'll grow them anyways. Construction speed. Uh, radio would be good as well. How many days left we got? 30, 30 is not too bad. Could use more war support. Um, grab the more defense too. As long as Broken Coast dies, we can defend against everyone else. Camel will be a bit of a problem, but that's alright. Uh, encourage women to serve? Why not? It's only 30 day focus. Seems pretty good to me. Any planes here? Uh, unfortunately, not yet. We'll work on it though. So, researches. That wouldn't be bad. Yeah, up all the hang dogs. Get more science points. Don't have, oh, actually, we're losing money. Hmm. That means we need to do some technology that maybe get us more money, perhaps? To get the Washington Brother is awfully tempting because these guys are just a giant mess right now. Holy cow. Take them out. Take out Capitol Hill. We could. It's not a bad idea. There we go. Go ahead. If we can take a tile, I'll be happy with that. Even if it's just one. This should be fine. This should be more than fine, too. And... There you go. Well, and boom. North Scooper taking an array. Great. Go 
Go ahead. Uh, sure, safe haven. Thanks a lot. Establishing armory as well. Wouldn't that be lovely? Looking all right overall. Do a couple planes here and there. Oh, probably don't want to be training right now. Because while our navy's not bad, I'd rather not lose them. We take one, two tiles. That'd be great. Is this a trade node? New Victoria is a trade node. Good to know. Uh, thinking about the birth of a mine. Uh, robots were always a hot topic, even when they weren't created yet. Pre-war people were always afraid that one day robots would rise up and destroy humanity. Um, uh, <clears throat> smarter minds thought that robots were just a way to do things without human using human hands, but the smartest of the thought of robots were signs of things to come. Of a new steel age, robots were always helping pre-war people, doing their chores, performing menial tasks, and protecting human lives. Pre-war governments and organizations created warbots with lasers, saws, and flamethrowers so that unfeeling steel could destroy vulnerable flesh. Even though this was a violation of the first law of robotics, no one cared. Ro robots became destroyers, killers, and murders because humans thought of them as tools, and efficient tools they were. Our scientists have been inspired to create a perfect machine AI, gathering much support from our scientific community. They requested government's assistance in the research to build a perfect AI, capable of improving itself. They already have some ideas about what to use it for, but to leave it to us to decide what the ultimate purpose is. Military requires robotic support. Our industry could use some help. Well, in all honesty, do we even have a ro robotic tech at all? We're average. Uh, our industry could use some help. That makes more sense to me. Automated warfare? Yeah, we're not going to automated warfare, so we're not going to do that one. Threads of life? Sure. This is good for army speed as well. Or tariffs, fine. Disruption armory. Oh, what else we got here? Fight refugees, doctor. Oh, this one. Just some of the weapons because we can. <coughs> so we've lost how many? 106 versus. It's almost a thousand, it's not bad. You yeah, only need one person to do that. Don't need both of you. There you go. It's taking a while to do. And bop. Oh, you know what? I said did say we need more money. We're gonna come down this way then. Um yeah. Political power, caps, passive caps, yeah. That's what we need to do. Oh, now we're lacking a lot of stuff here. Ooh. Go ahead, it's fine, whatever. You... Assembling weapons, relics of war... Sure. So you need trade, we could use some scrap next to you. Basically one east port, it's not bad. Metal working for extra money, I'm gonna keep doing this one too. So far, not bad. I'm gonna keep going this way. God dang it, guys. Miss Murder the Cold Honest than it had to be. Let's guess we'll get done this way. Got 38%, it's not bad. Take one or two tiles, it's fine. I'll take more resources. And just in case, we're gonna sell the resources for a few more caps. For now. Sure, why not? We need a lot more radios. We need a lot of things here now. Oof. Well, is it looking rough or what? Wow. And hopefully, Washington and Washington and Washington doesn't have a lot of strength. We'll take them out before they get too strong. 
And Capitol Hill's a trade node, right? More resources is good. Yeah, Seattle. Um, I'm gonna go metal scrap. That'd be pretty nice. Back up here too. Resistance growth speed goes down, which is nice. Now we're really gonna lose a lot of money, aren't we? Oh yeah. And that's a trade. That's a captain come, sure. Captain come, sure. Why not? Threads of life, the choice. If you don't know about this one, please go ahead. I've heard this one pretty recently, so. I'm saying life around us. Humanity has evolved to the world around it. Human supremacy. Yeah. We'll go with that one. Center of technological excellence. Yeah. Hey, look at this Capitol Hill. That's good, at least. Hey, not bad. Darn, I wanted Seattle. Bro. Uh, you know, we'll take it this way. Just so that we take as much as we possibly can. That might piss them off to come fight us. Northwestern Brotherhood now. Dan, huh? Generic book tree. So. Oh god, how long is this gonna take? Yeah, that's a long, 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 long. Okay, So we gotta wait for this one to finish. We got a little scrap. Um, oh, and also this one down here, the Gold Lives, which is not bad. Admire the old designs, old soldiers, new tricks. Dedicate supply officers is not bad. And proper fighting force. So we're going to go through all these stuff, and then we'll kind of take a slight break, and then make sure that we do okay, and hopefully we don't get war declared upon us. It's time. Let's go in against the Northwestern Brotherhood and see what type of damage we can do. I should have probably given orders to do this. My bad. But let's go in and have a good time. They have up to 24 divisions, which is not good for us. Um, but looks like we might have a little bit more. We might be able to encircle them. We might be able to do a few things here and there. We'll see. Hopefully the Special Forces can do well for us. If not, I mean, they're pretty strong. We're going to a few things here and there. Uh, we'll see. Uh, we'll see what we can throw on here. Brr. Why not? Kodiak base. Just take everything you possibly can right now. Everything that they don't, can't keep together, it's totally fine. Oh, hello. Oh, they're coming through Bellingham. That's not good. Our markets. Uh, expand care and security. Hope they don't spread out too much. Here, here. Hopefully, we can do okay. Up to 22 divisions. So, we're halfway to capitulation, which is good to see, but still. Uh, excuse me, guys. You might want to come through here. That might be best. You can encircle some power armor. That is quite optimal, quite honestly. Um, going to go and serve for volunteers. We're going to need that day event for me. There's that pretty normal. You guys do this, please. That'd be great. Get in here. Well, uh, go through here. Why not? You got encircled. Not ideal. But at least they got encircled too. So that's good at least. Uh, go here. This got Bellingham back. That's good. Find and circle destroy. Not ideal. You're gonna actually have to defend here. They have the special forces and power armor. I'm um, just the same thing, but whatever. Go and destroy them. Getting rid of those divisions would be the best. Hey, there's Seattle. Yay. Go, oh, got rid of that group. Nice. Uh, they really wanted North Cooper, didn't they, huh? Oh, we'll see. Expand care and security, increase trade tariffs. We're actually doing okay now. We're making 45 caps every month. That's pretty good. Uh, you guys. As much as I want to do focus on that, we're gonna focus over here. These guys have got to die. 
Now here is not so great, but it is what it is here. You know what? They're doing that anyways, so you can do that. Yakima Hill. They might be able to do that too. Hey, not bad. Second battle for Hoover Dam. See what you can do up here as well. And circle, and circle, and circle, and circle. Just go up through here. Now we get two divisions, maybe, maybe not. We'll see. And I would like some more war support, actually. I prefer the political power, but that's just me, maybe. Get in there. Medivac, good. Still had time. We'll come to this one next. And encirclement, not bad, not great, but not bad. Nice. Bay City, get up there too. Get Zap, ooh, not ideal. So defend until you die, basically. No longer increasing your power, which is fine. Tons of army XP, they're getting there. That's good. Uh, we're going to go down to here. Store Nasui. Sure. <clears throat> um, oh, we got to finish up first. So we got to save some of this army XP first. All right. Oh, let's see if we can save them. I don't know if we really can or not. Do straight tear out. So we might lose a division here. You know, it's my fault. Doctor? No, we lost a division. They're going to die for that. There we go. Rapid deployment. Since we're here, uh, let's go Wasteland Tactics. Grenades it is. And Rider Gear, not quite. There you go, we'll do that one. Can you just go in? Backyard workshops are good. And we got him. Quite, we took quite a few casualties, unfortunately, but it is what it is, you know. At least we got Seattle. Cool. It's not bad. We're not doing fantastic, but we have a lot of the north to take out. Up here in the north, um, you know, we got to take out the Northern Coalition. Whistler might not be bad. But, mm, New Victoria is not great. Whistler. Oh, that gives us a much more open area to take these guys out, so I'm not planning it out so we can go to war with them soonish. Um, take them to Victoria, too. Need an enabling vape for the Hattie Confederation, but I think I'm it there for the first episode. It's not bad. Next episode, we'll, we'll still play as Coover, but we'll take out the northern here, northern area, form um, Cascadia, and maybe push further down south, maybe. Maybe we'll end up with the Troll Warren, so I don't know. But if you enjoyed the video, though, please consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow in the next episode. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.